Hey everybody, welcome back to story time. This is uh, Wednesday, March the 16th, and tomorrow is St. Patrick's Day. Don't forget to wear your green or what happens? If you don't wear your green, somebody might pinch you and you don't want that. So make sure you wear your green and um, look for um, rainbows and pots of gold and little leprechauns. Um, that's always fun to do. So, uh, just reminding you, if you haven't got your March packet, please come by and get it. Uh, you'll get these at Storytime. Make sure you sign up if you want to come to Storytime in person. Uh, we'd love to have you. Just please sign up. You'll get this, which has everything in it you'll need for March. You can always go back and watch uh, the previous Storytimes um, that we've done. And um, so just come by the library and say, hey, I need a March packet, and we'll get you one, okay? All right, so today, letter of the day, last week was S, so this week is T, Q-R-S-T. What is a word that starts with the letter T? Tori, Miss Tori's name starts with the letter T, and also, what is this? It's a turtle. Look what you get to color today, a turtle. So get out your alphabet page and your counters and make sure you find that T on there. And you can color that turtle. What color is a turtle? Turtles are green. Look for St. Patrick's Day, how cool is that? So go ahead and color your turtle and find your T. Make sure you go around the house, try to find some T words, t -t -t toys. Um, I'm drawing a blank on T words, table, all kinds of things. So that's your letter of the day. Today is T. And the story we're gonna read today is called t Ten. There's another T word, 10 lucky leprechauns. Oh my goodness, look at this. 10 lucky leprechauns. You can count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So let's see what these leprechauns are getting into today. Ten lucky leprechauns. Oh look, look there, he's got a whole pot of gold there. Wouldn't that be fun to find something like that? The woods are full of leprechauns and treasures to uncover. Fiddle to fizz, there's magic there is when leprechauns find each other. Look, look at that butterfly and the flowers. We may start seeing some flowers show up as it's getting closer to spring. One leprechaun hears a noisy wee elf who's playing a squawky kazoo. Fiddle to fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number two. Look, one, two. Look, what's he doing? He's playing a kazoo. Have you ever played one of those? Those are fun. You just hum, in, hum into them. Oh, looky there. Now there's two of them. Wonder what they're gonna get into. Two leprechauns find a busy wee elf who's painting an orange spotted tree. Fiddle to fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number three. Excuse me, Miss Tori sneezing. Oh, number three, look at there, she's painting. What's she doing there? Looks like she's painting on the trees. Oh, do you think that's what little leprechaun elves do outside? They paint the trees? They might. Three leprechauns spy nimble wee elf who romps on the green forest floor. Fiddle de fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number four. So now we have one, two, three, four leprechauns. Oh, look what she's doing. She's just dancing around in the forest. Look at all that green. Oh, mercy. Four leprechauns see a silly wee elf who splats in a belly flop dive. Fiddle de fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number five. Look at him. <laughs> Look at what he's doing. He's in there 
swimming in the pond. He's got his lemonade. Look, he's in the frog down here. He's looking at that saying, what in the world are you doing? So look, all of them's there now. Look like they're going to have a big old party for St. Patrick's Day, I bet. Five leprechauns. Watch a jolly wee elf who's practicing juggling tricks. Diddle de fizz. Tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number six. Look at that. I listen to those rhyming words too. We've been um, listening for rhyming words and shapes. So maybe you can look at those while we read this story. Look at here. Look, there's a circle for a ball. Look, he's juggling. Look at that leprechaun. Now there's six of them. Six leprechauns spot a speedy wee elf who zooms by. Engines are revving. Fiddle de fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number seven. <gasps> Look, she's riding the motorcycle. Look at that. Or no, is that a, yeah because her engine's going. So she's, well, look, she's pedaling. I think she's on her bike. Look at that. Look at the dust flying. Oh, she's gonna join the, the other six and add her and it makes number seven. We got seven leprechauns now having a big old time. Seven leprechauns glimpse a lively wee elf who's balancing on the old gate. Fiddle de fizz. Tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number eight. <gasps> There's eight of them now. What, look, at he's standing on top of that. He could be in the circus, couldn't he? Remember we read about the circus last week. He looks like he could be in the circus doing all those tricks. <laughs> look at all those leprechauns. Eight leprechauns view a frisky wee elf who's zipping through trees on a vine. <gasps> Fiddle de fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number nine. <gasps> oh, now there's nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And here comes number nine in the forest. Swinging on the vine. Nine leprechauns meet a clever wee elf who's hunting for treasure and then fiddle de fizz, tis magic it is. It's leprechaun number 10. Oh look, this leprechaun's looking for treasure. Look, there's a rainbow there on the X and he's trying to follow the Follow the map to find the treasure. I wonder if there's a pot of gold there. Oh my goodness, look. Look, they're all kind of looking around, aren't they? 10 leprechauns find a big pot of gold and the place where the bright rainbow ends. Fiddle de fizz, the true magic is Finding 10 leprechaun friends. Yes, we did. We did find 10 leprechauns and they are all doing all kinds of different things and they all got together and they found that big pot of gold. Did you like that? That's a, that's a really uh, colorful book. You can come by and check it out at the library if you want to. And I'll be right back with a really, really fun craft. You guys are gonna like this, okay? I'll be right back. Hey everybody, welcome back to story time. Today's craft is look what you get to make. You get to make a little leprechaun. <gasps> Did you like that story? Those 10 little leprechauns? I hope you counted along with Miss Tori. That was a fun book and I really liked it. And you're gonna get in your packet you are gonna get everything you need. Miss Tori cut out most of the pieces for you, so all you have to do is glue them together. You're gonna get all these pee pee piece pieces in a little bag. And this right here, the orange part, his beard, the leprechaun's beard, is gonna be your handprint. So there's an orange piece of paper there you can trace your hand, and um, you can practice cutting it out or get somebody to cut it out. And you're gonna glue all these together and you get this fun little leprechaun. I think he was so cute. I knew you guys would like making that. 
and also for today uh, for a game that you can play at home an activity with your family is follow the leader we like playing that here at story time so you can show your child how to follow different movements um, and then you can give them a chance to be the leader you can walk forwards and then you can walk backwards or you can decide what to do with your hands while you're walking around. Follow the Leader was always a fun game that we played in school. And it works on cognitive flexibility and focus and attention because they're watching you and they're following what you're doing and so they can focus on when you switch movements. Um, but it's always a fun game to play around the house. Get with brother or sister. You can play follow, follow the leader with them too. I hope you enjoyed today's story time. And I'll be back next week. It's getting closer to spring. So um, I'll see you next week. Have a great week and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.